56 SNP MPs. I mean, that's brilliant. It's on. Interref 2 is on. Scotland is hungry for independence. Yeah, I think it's right that they settle into Westminster for a bit. You know, play them at their own game. Just you wait. Nicholas said it's on, so it's on. Interref 2, here we come. No, I think it's right that she said it's now not on. I mean, we don't even know the terms of Brexit yet. Voting SNP in the 2017 general election is how we get the NDF2 that Nicola just uh, put on hold. Ian Blackford just led all of our SNP MPs out of Westminster in protest. NDF2 is on. No, Blackford was right to lead them all back into the chamber after lunch. I mean, with full bellies, they can really focus on stopping Brexit. Vote SNP at the general election to stop Brexit because that's the mandate Scotland needs. Look, there was no way that the SNP could have stopped Brexit. No, 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 no. Boris is the one who puts lies on buses, not our Nicola. This pandemic is awful. I worry about my relatives. But Nicola's got this. Can you imagine living in England right now? Look, even with daily briefings, not even Nicola could have predicted that putting infected COVID patients into quarantine care homes would have killed so many people's grandparents. Tory austerity is killing vulnerable Scots. The sooner that Scottish government gets control of social security, the better. No, they were raised to delay social security Scotland. I mean, I know people have starved to death and killed themselves over this, but that's entirely Westminster's fault. A million list votes for the SNP got us two whole seats. <laughs> Bargain! A plebiscite referendum. <laughs> No sensible person would suggest that's a plausible route to independence. Nicola's de facto referendum plan is pure genius. It's the perfect route to independence. Nicola Sturgeon was the greatest first minister we've ever had. And she resigned on her own terms with no trauma, no scandal, only brave leadership from a hashtag girl boss. I do, I think it was strategic genius for Peter Murrell to let himself get arrested. I mean, that's the difference between Hollywood and Westminster. Integrity. Yo, yo, I'm in the light at the end of the tunnel. Paper stacks, yeah, I got them in the bundles. Harry Potter breaking bread with the muggles. They said I wouldn't make it, now they looking puzzled. They said I wouldn't take it, how to go and hustle. Get the bag, it ain't never getting fumbled. 